pass. Aha, get out of my way, soldier. Gilda was in the uh, Dark Parables, you're right. Living Legends for Snow Queen. I forgot about that. That's the one that's all icy. Yeah, I, have, I still need to play that one. Maybe I'll add that. You know what? I'm going to write that down. I'm going to write that down. Living Legends Snow Queen. I think that'll be a nice festive one. I don't think I've played that one. I'm just writing on my notepad here. Uh, let's unlock the Jack Frost here. Oh, maybe a rose? Oh, make him human again or something. There we are. We somehow managed to find ourselves with a iron cup. Okay. Interesting. Ah, uh, look, there's somebody up here. Somebody's up in the window. I'm not sure about the idea of wrapping presents, frankly, anymore. I, I don't know. It seems so wasteful. It's funny, I was thinking about Wardfire the other day, and uh, Wardfire is very particular, for those of you that maybe don't know that. <laughs> but, uh... She's, she, when she unwraps her presents, like every little piece of tape and every fold is done organized. Uh, but for me, when I unwrap my presents, I just tear into it, right? Like it's just paper, tear into it. So anyways, I'm sure that you all can relate to that. Somebody in your family is one of those ones that tears into the presents and somebody else is the one that meticulously unwraps it. So, uh, what are we doing here? Other than watching him eat candy canes. Oh, it actually shows us where the uh, collectibles are, too. Huh. Interesting. You neatly unwrap your curse, do you? Hello, good sir. What do we have here? Puzzle piece. Looks like we can sharpen something. We need all three of them! Tin Soldier, Nutcracker, and Ballerina. Here we are. We have two coins and a pallet amulet. I think we can deal with that back outside. You tear into yours? Yeah, I, when I was growing up we had a fireplace. Um, like an old school fireplace with like wood or whatever. And all the Christmas wrapping would just go right into the fire. So why, what? Like, there was no recycling of it. You just threw it in the fire. Nowadays, you just, you recycle it. Because I don't have a fire that I can just throw in random loose paper into. Okay, here we go. Mm-hmm. The button is missing. I should find it. Let that be a lesson. Yeah, it's always a gamble when you don't have a home inspector, but that's all about it being in a buyer's market right now for homes. Sellers can get away with that kind of stuff. Okay, so we need something to stick these two back together. I think we need, like, glue and then we can paint? Like, this is standard elephant game. Look at all this stuff. So much inventory here, it's kind of funny. Oh, we have to be here. Uh. Hmm. Something going on here. This is what we need to build. I don't know what we're going to use to stick this together. Hmm. Unfinished ballerina figurine. So that's definitely something. Uh, paint? Apparently paint is indeed what we need. Hmm. Well, my current home, I don't actually have any kind of fire at all. My last home, I had a gas fire. 
So you can't like throw paper into a gas fire. It runs on natural gas. Uh, okay. So, back here we go. Struggling here. What am I supposed to be doing? I need a key for this. Oh, the sap. Yes, thank you so much. I see that. I need to cut this. Do we not have our knife still? We do not have our knife anymore. Let's go. Let's assemble this animal here. Please. Please? Oh, we gotta melt it first. Of course we do. Uh, of course we do. What do you buy for an 11 year old? Does the 11-year-old use an iPad? Because I find that iTunes cards seem to work pretty good if they have an iPad. Uh, maybe not the most personal gift to buy, but... Alright, let's go this way. Now we have some liquid sap. Here we are, we're gonna be building. Oh, here we go. The sap is already applied, aren't we lucky? It's a reindeer. <gasps> paint it, paint it. I like painting. Paint the stand. Paint him in his face. And his chest and his antlers. Oh, I feel terrible for the Dillinghams. Jim is a good friend. He helped me open this shop. I owe him a lot. Hmm, that's more money than I can afford. I can only give you half. But there is someone who might be able to help with the rest. Our friend, Alex Wilson. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This guy just gave us $50,000? He just had that in his back pocket? $50,000. Wow, that is one heck of a friend. Alex doesn't trust a lot of people. But if you bring me a paper and quill, I'll write him a note so he'll help you. Okay, write me a note. What does he need? I have paper. And I have a quill. Hurry, young lad. Together, we just might help the Dillinghams have a Merry Christmas after all. Seriously, he just gave me $50,000 in gold coins. Bag of money. <laughs> Woo! We have one big bag of money. Nice. See ya. <laughs> we're we're out of here. We're heading to Barbados. We won't be back. No more, no more, no more, no more. This is Alex Wilson's house. That must be... Alex. Here's the note. Hello, Oliver. I see Michael trusts you. In that case, so do I. I'm afraid I'm in trouble, though. My daughter, Chloe, is missing. This is her favorite toy. Will you help me find her? Mm-hmm. What would you do with $50,000 if somebody just handed you $50,000? Oh, hello there. Uh, hi. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was actually really good. Oh no! You scared him away, you silly thing. Hmm. Alex waits outside the house for his daughter Chloe's return. He's on edge. I must help him. Uh, I don't know how you keep a bag of... Oh, hello. A bag of money in your back pocket. The hill looks too steep. I'd better use something like a sled. Hmm, interesting. Oh, this is quite the outside uh, setup here. The knight's missing his helmet. 
Maybe we use the toy to like get the dog sniffers out? I don't know. Wow, there's a lot of ladders on here. The window's locked. I need a special amulet to open it. Of all the things I have, that is not one of them. Wow, a sliver of a moon? There should be a little person sitting on there fishing. Okay, so I have uh, two coins. Uh, where do I use Chloe. those things? Go back this way. Uh, button is missing. Hmm. A file. Uh, maybe we can use the file here? Yep. There we are. $50,000 to go book shopping? Paying off bills? Yeah, paying off bills would be the responsible thing to do, wouldn't it? It would. Not going on a six month long vacation somewhere? That would be irresponsible. Okay. So, we still need to figure out what to do here. Oh, we could probably file this guy off. Yes, he did say he's Chloe, didn't he, Megan? Chloe! Chloe! Alright. There we are. Beautiful. It's all coming together now. Oh. I could smooth this dancer's edges with a file. Wait, is that like an innuendo or something? I'm gonna go smooth the dancer's edges. <laughs> Look at that smoothing job we're doing. Mm-hmm. Wow, and she magically got painted too. She's a dancer. Oh, we gotta pose these things. Oh boy. Dance for me, dance for me! Gotta get that leg down, it's too high. Uh, I feel like this looks pretty good. Whoa! He's gonna strike the Tidden Soldier down. Uh, which part is wrong? Um... I'm not sure... Which arm? This one? Oh! Yeah, there we go. Whoa! We did it! Thank you so much for your help with that one. You'd buy a small piece of land and buy it and build a small home? Yeah, I, I think you could do that with $50,000, depending on where the land is. How much property do you need? Bigger houses just mean more cleaning. Find missing pieces of statues and place them where they belong. It's one of the main reasons why I moved to a smaller house. Uh, hmm. Interesting. Oh, apparently that goes there? Yes, it does. Put that right there. Hmm. That would be an eye that goes over there. That's got to be part of the, the horse armor. Hmm. I'm not sure where this goes. Oh, that's his arm. It's missing. Aha! It's all coming together now. Puppy Doug, it's a douche. It goes there. Where does this go? Wow, there's actually more? Hmm. 
This is actually pretty interesting. Like, I find this 